working together to connect. When we discard digital devices such as computers, smartphones, televisions and tablets, they become e-waste. Hazardous toxins from e-waste can accumulate in the soil, water and air and pass through the food chain, becoming a health risk. Children and young people are especially vulnerable. In 2019, we generated 53.6 million metric tons of e-waste worldwide, up 21% in five years, making e-waste a growing challenge. However, digital devices as well as information and communication technologies can also have a positive impact on the environment, such as in climate action, helping us monitor, mitigate and adapt to climate change. ITU members have co-created a report on ICTs and the environment. The report looks at the growing challenge of e-waste and presents existing solutions for its safe disposal and use by providing an overview of global patterns and trends in the increase of e-waste, by focusing on education and awareness of the hazards posed by e-waste, and by exploring the development of e-waste strategies. Policies should focus on supporting recycling and refurbishment, and products should be designed to include end-of-life and end-of-use management. ICTs can help us mitigate climate change, especially emerging technologies like artificial intelligence, earth observation and big data. The report focuses on how new technologies, systems and applications can monitor the climate and reduce its impact. It provides guidelines to best practices on climate change monitoring and mitigation strategies, socially and culturally appropriate policies, need to support cost-effective, readily available and sustainable technologies, helping us ensure a healthier and more sustainable planet. Working together to connect. www.itu.int